okay you guys i'm so sorry um the earlier video i had to get off because my phone was actually about to die out but i was trying to let you guys know that um i was actually going to the library to be able to get my um taxes done so um what i wound up doing i, I um just was just driving down the street just driving down the street for some reason i can't never remember that area so i'm just kind of like just you know paying attention to what i'm doing and then all of a sudden you guys i hear a boom and when i say boom i mean boom you guys it was a mac truck on the left hand side of me um and it was um like say for instance it was a two lane you guys and the mac truck was right on the side of me and then it was like some other people behind me and then all of a sudden um I just seen just the, um, I guess the tire of the Mack truck, the actual uh, wheel wind up just going out. I'm talking about when I say like stuff just like all over the place, all over the place. So then I had to wind up rear over to the right. You guys, if I was on the highway and that happened, I most definitely would have been dead. And when I say dead, I mean dead. I would have went over. I had to kind of wash myself over to the right hand side. And I just truly, truly thank God that I am still alive because you are so, you never know when your last day is here. That's how bad you guys it was. And I was just so freaking shooken up. And I could tell the lady behind me, I think she had to like veer over and she was frantic too. And I could tell she wanted to stop. Um, we kind of, we didn't stop because the actual Mack truck was on the left hand side and we seen everything was okay. But I even seen the Mack truck, it kind of like reared and went over to the right hand side. So I could just truly say not only me, but the person behind me and the person on the side of me, they most definitely could have died today. They could most definitely have died today. Today. So today, let me know that if you are planning to do anything, go ahead and do it because our life is not promised like tomorrow for real our life is not promised tomorrow so you guys let me tell you the rest of it so all of a sudden when I, that finally happened so i was on my way to the library and i finally got to the library i'm all shooken up you guys and i supposed to you supposed to go between 11 30 and 1 30 so you can be able to get help with your taxes if not you guys the lines be i'm talking about when i say crazy long i mean crazy freaking long so when i went in um the guy he was like um you know asked me have you been here before and i was like he had like a little attitude i don't know what his problem was and I was like well yeah I came last year before he was like no have you already signed in I was like no I haven't signed in so I wind up signing in trying to be nice to him and maybe because it was a whole bunch of people there he kind of had a bad attitude I don't know what it was so you guys like it's taking real long I finally signed in I filled out the paperwork and that probably took about like probably maybe about a good 10 minutes to fill out the paperwork so I'm just sitting there chilling just sitting there chilling uh, 30 minutes went past almost an hour went past and I'm looking like why have they not waited on me yet and I see it's a lot of people behind me but not a whole bunch of people so we just sitting there just sitting there waiting and then all of a sudden I just happened to bring out my cell phone and you guys know I did not see that it said no cell phones in there I mean it's nothing for us to do we just all just sitting in chairs row by row watching each other listening to each other social security numbers and and um, problems with their taxes so one thing they need to stop doing is having it so close so my thing is I truly appreciate them uh, having free tax services but you most definitely want to have it kind of more of a uh, so people won't hear your information but then all of a sudden i'm on my cell phone and he like um excuse me ma'am he was like you don't supposed to be on your cell phone and i said i am so sorry i did not see that over there he was like no no you you know what you're gonna just have to just go ahead and go home and i was like i am sorry so then he wind up having coming to me he eventually came to me they called my name and then all of a sudden he was like um do you have your social security number i mean your social security card and your id i had my id and I'm telling you guys, I was there for at least about an hour and a half before he asked me that. So he was like, well, no, you got to go home and go get your social security card. So I'm like, oh, my God, I probably probably about maybe 30 to 40 minutes away. So I had to go all the way home, get my social security card, which I wasn't tripping. OK, so I was like, you know what, since I'm going to go home, and go get my social security card. I'm going to go get me something to eat just in case it's like super duper busy because I didn't eat all day that day. So then I wound up going to get something to eat. I went back to the library. You guys, do you know I went to go sign it? He was like, um, again, treat me real bogus. I don't know if he had some against me or what it was. He was like, uh, did you finally go get your your your, uh, your social security card? I said, yes, sir. But my thing is, I was treating them nice. My thing is, sometimes when people treat you bad, kill them with kindness. When I kept on saying, yes, sir, yes, sir, he looking at me like, dang, she's supposed to be having a bad day. So you guys, finally I got a chance to sit down. Uh, an hour went past. Two hours went past, three hours went past. You guys, do you know, it took me at least about a grand total 
four hours just to get my taxes done. And now that to me is crazy. And don't get me wrong, I truly appreciate them having the free service, but I'm like, if you go have a free service, we should not have, and then they don't even let us use our cell phone. And you can't even use a freaking computer. When I pulled out my cell phone, he was like, you could be the feds, like acting crazy. I was like, sir, I just did not read it. And it was just, I just had a crazy day from um, almost getting into an accident. Crazy, super duper crazy, you guys. And, and I don't know if y'all heard at the beginning, I was um, on my way to the actual tax place and um, a Mack truck was on the left hand side of me. And then all of a sudden, all I heard was boom. I was like, what is really going on? Stuff just flying everywhere, y'all. The Mack truck tire just flying everywhere. People behind me just going crazy. And I had to like zero over to the right. So today has been a very crazy day, but a blessed day because I could most definitely be dead. So you guys just wanted to come quick, tell you guys. <sighs> Woosa. That's what I'm going to do, you guys. Just live life. Be happy. Um, if you haven't, you guys, make sure you follow me on Periscope, you guys. Take care, and thank you so much for watching. Bye, you guys. Take care. Be blessed.